Natalia Savenko was born in Russia. At a young age, she, along with her family, moved to her father's home city, Mykolaiv, Ukraine. It's there that she spent her childhood before moving to Canada at the age of 21. But after a series of bombings Saturday nights, Natalia awoke to the following footage showing what used to be a school in her hometown. It felt just like a shock and like it's not happening in this reality. The news coincides with a series of concerns for family and friends. Natalia's father has not been heard from since March 3rd, while a close friend has fled the country. I haven't heard anything uh, from my dad because I have no means to uh, contact him yet. Um, one of my friends is still uh, in Hungary waiting for the visa to be opened up for um, Canada. In response to the conflict, Natalia is sewing Ukrainian flags. As an embroiderer in Lloyd Minster, she's selling her work and donating proceeds to the Red Cross. That was my first thought, like, what can I do, what can I, how can I use my skill, and it just happened right away. People are coming over to purchase them, people that are not even related to Ukrainians in any way. They're messaging me from all over Saskatchewan or Alberta, and I mail them. With more than 100 flags sold to date, nearly $4,000 has been raised already. Natalia says she's not done yet. This is the way we're going to help and we will keep doing it. And we'll spread the war word um, and show everybody how uh, brutal the, this assault has been on our country.